Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim Hello friends, welcome to my channel In this video you will learn how to price booked itinerary Emirates itinerary pricing, prices flight segments The system prices in currency of country of origin and includes equivalent amount to be paid when your journey does not originate in country where your terminal is located Amidus itinerary pricing transactions allow you to price a booked itinerary with or without name element depending on which transaction you use you can use FXX transaction prices without creating TST transaction store ticket record and name element is not mandatory FXV transaction prices and create TST transaction store ticket record and name element is a mandatory how to price itinerary without create transaction store ticket record to price a PNR or booked itinerary with or without name element you can use FXX transaction in this case it will not create TST transaction store ticket record containing information needed to issue ticket in our PNR itinerary book and our passenger would like to know price before issue ticket to price all segments and passenger without creating TST transaction store ticket record use FXX transaction enter system proposes the lowest fare for book classes here repeat your price transaction was used fare line numbers fare basis discount column passenger total fare including taxes and local currency Saudi real as per office location message column tax information why means yes tax included fare valid for e-ticket only message stock restriction warning message for fare number one and two fare families and upsell message to view ticket image use FQQ transaction followed by 2 fare 2 from display list of fare here is the last date of ticketing message price itinerary segments fare basis not valid before and not valid after baggage allowances published fare in Saudi Riyadh taxes total fare fare calculation fare families and upsells messages how to price itinerary and create a transaction store ticket record in PNR or booked itinerary already contains name elements you can use FXP transaction in this case it will create TST transaction store ticket record which containing information needed to issue ticket at a later stage to price all passenger and all segments in a PNR use FXP transaction enter system proposes the lowest fare as there is only one fare applicable for booked itinerary here transaction was used to price passenger name last date of ticketing price itinerary segments fare basis not valid before and not valid after baggage allowances public fare in Saudi Riyadh as per point of sale taxes and total fare fare families and upsell messages Let's go back to our PNR. Enter RT transaction. As you can see, TST indicator in PNR header shows that TST was created. FE endorsement element, FE validating area, automated added for segment number two and three in a PNR. Proposed valid fare is valid until end of transaction. So you need to save the changes in a PNR. How to select transaction store ticket record? For example, more than one applicable fare proposed by booked itinerary to select fare 2 from display list of fare use FXE fare selection transaction followed by 2 fare 2 from display list of fare slash P passenger identifier followed by 1 passenger 1 enter selected fare displayed here repeat your transaction to select fare now you need to save changes in a PNR for further action how to price itinerary for multi passenger to, to price all passengers and all air segments in a PNR use FXP transaction to price and create TST transaction store ticket record enter system response with the list of fares and passenger details here transaction was used to price passenger name as per name elements in a PNR passenger type code CH for child ADT for adult and IN infant passenger type code number of passenger per price 
पब्लिश फेयर इन सऊदी रियाज एज पर योर टर्मिनल लोकल करेंसी टैक्स अमाउंट टोटल फेयर इंक्लूडिंग टैक्सेस पर पैसेंजर टोटल फॉर ऑल पैसेंजर अपसल फेयर इन लोकल करेंसी फेयर फैमिली फॉर बैगेज लास्ट डेट ऑफ टिकटिंग डेड लाइन एज पर पॉइंट ऑफ सेल फेयर वैलिड फॉर ई टिकटिंग ओनली वार्निंग मैसेज सेवन फिफ्टी सऊदी रियाज पेनल्टी अप्लाइज वार्निंग मैसेज यू नीड टू सेव चेंजेस इन पी एन आर फॉर फर्दर एक्शन हाउ टू सिलेक्ट ट्रांजेक्शन स्टोर टिकट रिकॉर्ड फॉर मल्टी पैसेंजर For example, to select fare two from display list of fare for both adult passenger number two and three, use FXC fare selection transaction followed by two fare two from display list of fare slash p passenger identifier followed by two dash three passenger number two and three. Enter selected fare displayed. Here, repeat your transaction to select fare. You need to save changes in the PNR for further action. How to price itinerary for specific passengers? To price specific passenger and air segments in a PNR, use FXP transaction to price and create a TST transaction store ticket record slash P passenger identifier followed by three passenger number three from PNR. Enter. System proposes lowest fare as there is only one fare applicable for booked itinerary for passenger number three. You need to save changes in a PNR for further action. How to price itinerary for all non-infant passenger? To price all non-infant passenger type who occupied seats in a PNR, use FXP transaction to price and create TST transaction store ticket record slash tax identifier for non-infant passengers who occupied seats. Enter. System responds with a list of fare details for child and adult non-infant passenger who occupied seats. You need to save changes in the PNR for further action. How to price itinerary for all infant passenger? To price all infant passenger who not occupied seat in a PNR, use FXP transaction to price and create TST transaction store ticket record slash INF identifier for infant passenger who not occupied seat. Enter. System proposed lowest fare as there only one fare applicable for booked itinerary for infant passenger. You need to save changes in PNR for further action. How to price itinerary for specific air segments? To price specific air segments for all passengers in a PNR. For example, Riyadh to London air segment four for all passengers in a PNR. Use FXP transaction to price and create TST transaction store ticket record slash S segment identifier followed by four air segment four from PNR. Enter. System responds with the list of fares and passenger detail for selected air segment number four of a PNR. You need to save changes in a PNR for further action. To price specific air segment and passenger in a PNR, for example, Riyadh to London air segment four and passenger number three in a PNR, use FXP transaction to price and create TST transaction store ticket record slash S segment identifier followed by four air segment number four of PNR. Slash P passenger identifier followed by three passenger three from PNR. Enter. System proposes lowest fare as there only one fare applicable for booked itinerary for selected options. You need to save changes in the PNR for further action. How to price itinerary and reduce specific percentage? To reduce published fare, for example, need to reduce 25% published fare and add Zulu Zulu ticket designator. Use FXP transaction to price and create TST transaction store ticket record slash Zulu Oscar identifier for zap off dash twenty five numeric value to reduce. So here we want to reduce twenty five percent followed by P percentage asterisk Zulu Zulu ticket designator enter. System proposes lowest fare as there is only one fare applicable for booked itinerary. And reduce twenty five percent published fare with required ticket designator. You need to save changes in a PNR for further action. How to price itinerary by fare basis with rule override? As per airline file, RBD's booking classes are, are not matched with booked itinerary. System throw an error message: no fares, RBD carrier passenger type. If still need to override some reasons, use FXV transaction to override booking class. Followed by one, fare one from display list of fare. Enter. 
system responded rbd override not permitted still need to override you can use pricing by fair basis use fxp transaction to price and create tst transaction store ticket record slash l identifier for override dash fair basis enter system purpose applicable for as required fair basis and override booking classes with warning message ticket by fair basis and no guaranteed for price you need to save changes in the pnr for further action how to price itinerary with corporate unifair to price corporate fair or negotiated fair or private fair use fxp transaction to price and create tst transaction store ticket record slash r identifier for request comma u corporate contract indicator asterisk followed by corporate contract number enter system proposes lowest fair as required corporate fair here transaction used to price itinerary corporate contract code you need to save changes in a pna for further action and that's it you have just learned how to price booked itinerary thanks for watching hope you like it